What's that sound? This is snake root, which is a native herbaceous perennial plant that can be found throughout the eastern and central United States, including here in Missouri. It thrives in shady, moist areas like the edges of forests and woodlands, and is particularly common along hiking trails and in disturbed areas. It grows up to four feet tall and is most recognizable by its clusters of small white flowers that bloom from late summer into fall. The leaves are opposite, meaning they grow in pairs along the stem. Each leaf is attached to a long petiole, as well as being sharply toothed, heart-shaped to triangular, and tapering to a point. The small fluffy white flower heads contain only disc flowers, with each floret in the flower head containing five petals, five stamen, and a single pistil. This plant is relatively easy to spot due to its bright white flowers and long blooming season of July to October. But when matured, the snake root will form small black achenes with feathery pappus that are wind dispersed. All in all, this would be an excellent plant to add to your landscape, especially on a forest edge. However, there is a hidden danger within this pretty plant. White snake root contains a toxic compound called trimetal, which is definitely not something that you should eat. A tricky thing about white snake root is that you don't actually have to eat it or touch it to get poisoned by the trimetal. Cows and other livestock can eat this plant while grazing and the toxin can then be passed on through their meat or their milk. And if you were to eat one of these products, then you yourself would come down with milk sickness. And this includes vomiting, diarrhea, and all that other good stuff. And it's believed that Abraham Lincoln's mother, Nancy Hanks Lincoln, died from this milk sickness. But don't worry, nowadays they manage pastures for snake root and they mix all the milk from a bunch of cows together to dilute any toxins that might have accumulated in one of the cows before they distribute the milk. So far, this has been working as the last recorded case of milk sickness in the United States was in 1963. All right, thank you all for watching. I hope that you enjoyed learning about white snake root with me. If you did, be sure to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you all in my next video.